Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So, yes, it is that time again. Time to take up a few more champions. In this video, we'll be taking up three six stars to rank three. And I will talk to you about my reasoning for each one of them uh, when the time comes. However, if you would like to guess which three I took up, feel free to leave a comment below. Uh, I have changed the format for at least my rank fours. Uh, I think it's a little bit better when I have just one rank up and I go through my options and that sort of thing. But for three, you can guess um, it'll be a little difficult because you probably don't remember which champions I have at rank four already or rank three already. Uh, but anyway, I'm about to reveal the first one in five, four, three, two, one, Emma Frost. So I watched, uh, I think it was Legacy. He doesn't have an Emma Frost yet. And I always liked Emma Frost. She was rank two for a long while. And I always intended to take her to rank three. And in a previous video, I told you guys that I'm on a mission to take up my rank twos to rank three and not have any more rank twos. Uh, they'll be either rank one, rank three, rank four, or rank five. No more rank twos, uh, at least for right now. Now, Emma Frost is actually a pretty uh, interesting character here. Um, despite being so sexy, uh, she has some utility. You know, in her telepath mode, she shuts down evaders. So that's very useful. And when she's in her diamond form, she's immune to all sorts of things, you know? And I, I, I do like using her, but I haven't found a great need to use her. She's got some good synergies. I think she has a synergy with... Um, Kitty Pride that uh, makes Kitty Pride immune to reverse controls. Um, but she's also a good champion in her own right. Uh, I remember reading uh, comics when I was younger. She was the White Queen. And she was, I think, in charge of the Hellfire Club. It's been a long time. And uh, I, I remember, I think it was, um, uh, was it X-Factor or X-Force? I can't remember, um, but uh, the Hellfire Club used to always fight with them, always. And I remember her from there. So that, that's been a very, very long time. And when I saw Emma Frost in the contest, I was like, yeah. Now, I didn't like her at first only because of the reverse control thing. When she came into the contest, I believe that was the first time we had reverse controls. Um, and I didn't like that. I've gotten used to it with her, but I've never really liked it. Uh, but anyway, Emma Frost is now rank three. No regrets so far, even though I'll probably just use her in, um, uh, the arena, uh, or as a synergy partner for Kitty. Um, I believe it was Kitty that had that, uh, synergy. All right. So that's the first one. The second one is going to be Karnak. Again, I told you. You see, he's ranked two. Now, you see Karnak needs both skill and cosmic uh, catalyst to rank up. Now, when I took Karnak to rank two, it was just before he got a rework. He's actually much better now than he was before the rework. Um, but he stayed at rank two because while it was a good um, buff for him, it wasn't such a good buff that I was racing to get him up to rank three. Well, now things are coming in a little bit more. We have seven stars about to come out. And so it's time to start getting my, my six stars 
uh, as many as I can up to rank three. That's how I did with my five stars. And that's how I'm doing with my six stars. So uh, I will be taking more and more six stars uh, straight to rank three uh, as often as I can, you know, possibly each level up. Um, but it depends on uh, how many resources they uh, give us. But Karnak is actually um, not bad. It's just that I haven't found a great use for him. I know on his special one, he can also shut down, um, I think, evade and auto block. I'm not sure. <clears throat> but I saw a video of Karnak way, I think it was in the beta or something like that. And he looked amazing. What he did to that winter soldier, I was like, whoa, Karnak used to be a beast. But apparently he was too good for that time. So. Uh, they took him down. And what we have now is not as good as that first video I saw of his, but much better than he has been, uh, at least in the contest. But I don't know. Uh, but he's another rank two that was stuck there. So with him, I only have one rank two left. And uh, yeah, we'll we'll take him up eventually um it was funny you you'll you'll see who it is uh in another video all right so that's the second rank up for the video and you can see the lag a little bit um but in any case the third and last is punisher 2099 now how many of you guys remember when i went for a feature and out of the entire feature there was only one champion that i didn't want all the other champions i would have been happy with the only one i didn't want the one that i considered the worst of the bunch was punisher 2099 i had my sister with me doing the uh, opening and what does she say she says, oh, yes, you're going to get that Punisher 2099. And I did. And she was like, oh, wait, no, you can't blame me for that. I was like, hey, everybody saw it. Everybody heard you. And here it is. All right. Well, since then, he actually has gotten uh, better. He's actually a, a fairly decent champion now. Um I probably still won't use him a ton, but he's actually not bad. And since I'll be likely using him in uh, the arena more than any other game mode, uh, the fact that he can kill quickly uh, in arena is nice. He also has um, a heal block. And uh, I believe he also has a little bit of a power control mechanism as well. I don't use him a ton, so uh, I'm trying to remember this from uh, the past. But his damage is, you know, is decent. Now, one of the things that I love doing with him, though, uh, he has this battery mechanism. While he has battery power, he can heavy spam and it is awesome uh if my opponent is like say less than half his health and i have a full battery <clears throat> i'll heavy him to death because after the heavy they're stunned and i can just keep heavying them <clears throat> as long as i have the battery once the battery is out they no longer get that stun after the heavy. So if they are just about to go down, you know, and some of them, because that heavy does some good damage. Um, <clears throat> I've taken out some with uh, half their health left and just spam that heavy until they were gone. So that is one of my favorite things to do with Punisher 2099. Uh, other than that, um, he's he's okay. He's okay. 
I I would not have ranked him up over some of the other techs that I had. Um, as far as the tech class goes, he's middle. You know, he's not terrible, but he's also nowhere near as good as some of the top end uh, techs like Nimrod, Warlock. You know, uh, Omega Sentinel. You know, these guys are are up there. You know, um, even even the new infamous uh, Iron Man. Uh, I would probably say is better than Punisher 2099. Uh, I know I've used uh, Infamous Iron Man way more in content and all of that, uh, even in Battlegrounds, uh, more than I've used uh, Punisher 2099. Um, but you never know. There will come content, and I'm sure uh, I'll find a use for him one day. All right, so anyway... That is going to do it uh, for the video. He's the last one uh, that I took up for this. Um, I think it was just one level up. I took all three, but I could be wrong. Um, there was a tech advancement on as well. All right. So take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought. And you all have a blessed day.